I'm out here. You can see I got the bucket on the tractor. That's right, right there. It's a little dirty, but that's all right. And I've got a quart of ash headed out for delivery. So what I'm gonna do, and you might think I'm nuts, is I'm gonna load these buckets up. I wanna know how many buckets of wood are in each tote. If I know that, then when I'm cutting, I'll be able to um, just take the number of buckets and I'll know if I have a third, two thirds or a full cord in the dump trailer. So uh, we'll put you on time lapse and uh, you can take a look at what I'm up to. we go on time lapse I'll just tell you that according to the math it should be four and a half buckets but uh, we're gonna test my theory so there you have it full bucket I'll turn you here and you can take a look It's neatly stacked in there so uh, hopefully um, just judging and I'll turn you back here just judging at that we're gonna be just about four and a half is my guess so I'll go dump this in the dump trailer and we'll come back and get bucket number two So judging by two two buckets, it looks like it's going to be four. I can see why it'd be four and a half, and I'll do that at the end. I'll, you know, it's probably four and a little bit. I think it was four point, I don't know, something. I don't remember now, but uh, I'll do an extra bucket at the end. And, uh, so I think probably what we're looking at is... Uh, 13 to 14 bucket loads would be certainly 13 would probably be right on a cord but uh, i like to give my customers a little extra it keeps them coming back and buying from me so uh, i'll probably do 14 buckets uh for a cord so uh but we'll see we'll uh just see how this works out i think i already know one of the uh advantages here that i'm having is is this is all split small at the customer's request and so i'm packing it in very tightly into the bucket if uh if this was standard firewood i think it would uh probably take an extra little bit to get it all in there but uh it is what it is you know um this is what the customer requested i want to be fair to them um you know, just uh, nature of the beast, having smaller, smaller chunks, you get less air space. Well, uh, very happy with the new saw. Um, didn't use it much, obviously, but uh, got a few cuts in with it. Um, I have to say, what a, what an advantage, uh, you know, a decade makes in technology. Um, you know, my 346 is a good saw, but uh, with that 550, I think we'll run circles around it. We'll have to try them out once I get the 346 up and running again. So I guess uh, I'm gonna say we have we have another bucket, bucket number three. 
So I'm gonna go and dump that and we'll come back and see if we can get the rest of this on one bucket load. That's it. So I think four buckets would be a cord. Um, I'm gonna steal a few out of this one. I'll fill that back up later. Um, but uh, you know, I wanna give, this is one of the greatest customers I have. So I'll go overboard for them. They've ordered a lot of wood from me. They tell a lot of people. Um, they're just nice people. And uh, I do enjoy uh, taking care of them. So that's one thing, you get a good customer, you wanna keep them. So I'm gonna say that four buckets equals E equals a third of a cord. I think I've been saying it equals a cord, but it's actually a third of a cord or a face cord. So uh, I'm gonna go dump this in the trailer and then uh, I think the rest of this I'll toss in. Uh, probably just go faster than loading this bucket, moving the tractor around. So uh, I'm gonna get on that. We got, we're all loaded up. We're ready to go to my customer site. I figured I'd show you exactly what we ended up with, with all those ash trees. So turning you around, got a little over a cord in here. Um, ended up putting 14 buckets in here. Just to make sure I had a cord plus. So uh, it's looking good. This is uh, some really good looking wood. Uh, some of this ash. Actually, you can see a piece here. It's starting to go the other way, but this is still good and hard and will light up real fast. So, um, so we're going we're gonna to get over there, get this unloaded at my customer's site. Uh, that's going to wrap it up for Woodruff Woods today, and we'll catch you on the next one.